Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> I pray your day has been blessed beyond measure up to this point, being that it's lunchtime for some and just midday for others. So we're going to see what our devotion has to share with us today. Rejoice and be thankful. As you walk with me through this day, practice trusting and thanking me along the way. Trust is the channel through which my peace flows into you. Thankfulness lifts you up above your circumstances. I do my greatest work through people with grateful, trusting hearts. Rather than planning and evaluating, practice trusting and thanking me continually. This is a paradigm shift that will revolutionize your life. This is a paradigm shift that will revolutionize your life. Man, check that out. Woo -woo. <laughs> God knows what to say, when to say, how to say, and who to say it to. Amen. Philippians 4 and 4, rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I say, rejoice. Psalm 95, 1 and 2. Oh, come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation. Let us come into his presence with thanksgiving. Let us make a joyful noise to him with songs of praise. Psalm 9 and 10. And those who know your name put their trust in you. For you, O oh Lord, have not forsaken those who seek you. You know, that's a a real good reminder for us today that we should continue to have a life rejoicing in the Lord. No matter what's going on, we should just rejoice. And again, I will say rejoice. And why do we rejoice? Because God's resume is perfect. You know, who wouldn't serve a God like that? You know, he, he just comes through for us, you know, whether we deserve it or not. Um, Sometimes we miss it because we're looking for it in a different way because he knows what's best for us. And, and we are planning, as it said earlier, because I am definitely guilty of that, planning and evaluating. I'm a planning, evaluating sister. And a lot of times it don't give me nothing but tears and anguish because I'm not in control. I keep telling myself, look, self, you're not in control. So those of us who know his name, we trust him. And that's why we can rejoice because he's been too good to us. You can't make me doubt him because I know too much about him. Is that your testimony today? So I just want to leave this one with you. Rejoice and be thankful as you walk through this day. And the reason for that, either you trust God or you don't. May you have a blessed beyond measure throughout the rest of your day. Because if you're looking at this, it's already blessed because you woke up. And the Lord said the same. I have a nugget for you tomorrow. God willing. Remember, make today great. It's the gift that wasn't promised. Peace.